Hey there, food lovers. Welcome back to Neri's Kitchen, your go-to channel for healthy and delicious recipes. I'm Neri, your host, and today we've got a fantastic recipe that'll warm your heart and soul. But before we get started, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button so you never miss our weekly healthy recipes. All right, let's dive in. Today, we're making a roasted butternut squash and chicken soup. It's the perfect blend of creamy and savory and is packed with nutrients. Now let's go over the ingredients, macros and calories. Let's start cooking. Step one, preheat your oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. Now that the oven's preheating, let's move on. In a large roasting pan, toss the cubed butternut squash with olive oil, salt, and pepper. Place the chopped onion on the pan as well. This step infuses a deep, rich flavor into the soup. The aroma is incredible. Season the chicken breasts or thighs with a bit of salt and pepper and place them on a separate baking sheet. The chicken will add a nice, savory touch to our soup. Roast the butternut squash, onion, and chicken in the preheated oven. The butternut squash and onion will take approximately 25 to 30 minutes, and the chicken will take approximately 20 to 25 minutes, or until the internal temperature reaches 165 degrees Fahrenheit for the chicken. Once everything is roasted and cooked, remove them from the oven. Let the chicken rest for a few minutes, then shred it into small pieces using two forks. Ah, the aroma is incredible. And now let's shred that tender chicken. In a large pot, combine the roasted butternut squash, onion, shredded chicken, vegetable broth, and dry thyme and ground nutmeg. Bring the mixture to a simmer and let it cook for about 10 minutes. Use an immersion blender to puree the soup until smooth. If you don't have an immersion blender, carefully transfer the soup to a regular blender in batches to puree, then return it to the pot. Look at that creamy texture, it's just perfect. Taste the soup and adjust the seasoning with salt and pepper as needed. It's all about that balance, folks. If you desire extra creaminess, stir in the Greek yogurt or low-fat sour cream. This gives it that delightful creaminess without adding too many calories. Reheat the soup gently if needed and then serve it hot. You can garnish with additional thyme, a dollop of Greek yogurt, or some freshly ground black pepper if desired. And there you have it, our roasted butternut squash and chicken soup is ready to enjoy. I hope you all enjoyed making this recipe with me. It's a hearty and protein packed version of the classic butternut squash soup. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more healthy recipes every week. And remember, if you're looking for more recipes or to get started on your healthy journey, head over to www.fitclub.fit. Thanks for joining me in Neri's Kitchen today. Stay healthy and keep cooking. See you next time.